A fourth group of Central African refugees have returned from exile in the Democratic Republic of Congo. They also met UN High Commissioner for Refugees, Filipino Grandi, during an official visit to the country. The group of returnees are part of a first ever voluntary repatriation program from DR Congo for around 172,000 people forcibly displaced from the Central African Republic since 2013. It was a joyous boat trip for these refugees as they sang cheerfully from the moment the boat left the dock in the Democratic Republic of Congo. The 200 passengers are part of the fourth group of Central African refugees returning from exile in the Democratic Republic of Congo to the Central African Republic for the first time in six years. Now, through a voluntary repatriation agreement signed in July between the government of the two countries and the UNHCR, that's the UN Refugee Agency, they are going home. I have come back to my country and my hope now is that my country can look after me. We are many and there are young children. We are all vulnerable. We want the government to come to our aid. Over 1,400 have returned so far as the UNHCR assists in voluntary repatriation from DRC since 2013. Hundreds more have returned from Cameroon and the Republic of Congo. The returnees were met at the port of Bongi, the capital of the Central African Republic, by Filippo Grandi, the UN High Commissioner for Refugees. In this moment, when we see refugees returning, we must remember that there are still many internally displaced in this country and they too deserve the help of international assistance as well as support from their own government. There are also hundreds of thousands of refugees on the other side of this river and also in Congo Brazzaville, in Cameroon, in Chad and other countries who also are waiting for their day of return. In the return of 13,500, and it is estimated that 127,000 have returned spontaneously. Returning refugees are provided with transport and a return package consisting of food rations for three months, cash and basic household items to help them initially once they are back in the Central African Republic.